what do you have to do if you go uh, from normal wheels like the wheels with uh, uh, just an uh, inner tube uh, to totally tubes. Uh, you have a thing in between that's tubeless. Some wheels are tubeless uh, ready or all tubeless and then you have uh, like a normal tire but it has all the special profiles that it just gets in the uh, in the wheel uh, base that uh, it's a it's keeping full but you don't have to the inner tube in my opinion you just choose uh, or inner tubes like this set or you go totally with the tubes like these ones what's better about the tubes uh, I don't I think you already know that but they drive smoother they are a little lighter on the wheel set uh, most people do like me they buy uh, the carbon wheel sets with a totally carbon uh, rim um, so the carbon uh, surface and uh, new ones do have the disc those don't have the disc so I have just the brake pads uh, here on the wheel set so but that's not the only thing this, uh, what you do have to think about you have to buy uh, new uh, braking shoes so these are the swiss tops most expensive ones are they better i think they are a little better but it's not necessary you can also just buy normal brake shoes and <laughs> don't worry you have them just in black but i like the yellow ones but that's just up to me Here you can see them better not as dirty and now special brakes but you don't have to buy the special uh, brakes because uh, these ones are uh, kind of expensive. Um, what you do need, if you want to change the tubes, uh, because they are totally glued on. So this is just the glue. Hope you can see that. Let me just show you better. Here in the better light, it's just the glue stuff. It's harder to get a tire on the tube wheel set than on the normal wheel set because this is just easier just uh, make this empty yeah you know that I think so <laughs> don't don't mind it um, but with these you have to take them off you don't get the glue off the uh, off the wheel you just let the just a little stuff the glue stuff on the wheel so it's a good uh, a good fit you take the new uh, glue like to Basti but you have also other brands and you take just a new uh, tube like this uh, Victoria this is with graphene that's kind of new it's a, it's a little bit more expensive uh, and to give you a tip don't do this this is very stupid to put this on the yeah, that's very stupid but I wanted to just make the video for you because I get a lot of questions about the tubes how easy is it to drive with them if you go flat so let me just uh, address that question uh, if you go flat you can't use just an inner tire with this just thing uh, so these go goes with just normal wheels with an inner tire then you're totally fine and you have like here uh, a normal pump um, or just uh, the how do you call it the the, the fast pump with the with the patrons patronum ah. but if you have the tubes you have to buy the glue this is I put it in the bidon so I don't want to open it but it is a, a bottle of Vittoria pit stop you can buy it for I think 10 bucks it's great uh, I use it and it's great if I go flat with the tubes just uh, fill it up here and the pit stop just fills the tires with glue so it will fill the tire it will also fill uh, the hole in the tire mostly in some case it won't and then you have a problem then you go call your <laughs> your girlfriend or your partner or whatever uh, or you just walk home so uh, but this tire can also go totally broke like 
and then you can also walk. So it's the same thing. You have the pit stop, just use it. Uh, for me it was successful when I got uh, a flat tire, so it was just great. And this pit stop uh, just puts in also the air in the tire, so uh, that's also okay. But of course you can just take the pump and just give it a little more. Or just also again with the pattern. So that's the same thing between the normal and the tubes. So uh, what's more, tubes are more expensive. This tire, this Vittoria, is uh, 100 bucks. And this one, uh, Grand Prix 4000 S2, good tire, is I think uh, 30 bucks. So, and uh, those don't last longer. So those are more expensive. They uh, last, I think, a little shorter than those. So it's not the cheapest option. But the tubes, it just drive very nicely and uh, a little lighter in my opinion so you go faster with the tubes and that's why you see the riders in the Tour de France but also in the other courses all pros just use uh, tubes with no exceptions uh, totally no exception so it's up to you of course some people use these ones uh, just uh, for the criteria for just the races and they just go training with these ties and that's also the thing for me but because i'm testing a lot of the tubes i just uh, use the tubes now for just all my rides so i can test them all so if you want to see them i'll put the link below this video for the total test thanks for watching hope you liked it and rated with a little thump